Whatever the result may be, I shall carry to my grave the consciousness, that I at least meant well for my country. The ballot box is the surest arbiter of disputes among free men. There is nothing stable but heaven and the Constitution. Our union rests upon public opinion, and can never be cemented by the blood of its citizens shed in civil war. The storm of frenzy and faction must inevitably dash itself, in vain against the unshaken rock of the Constitution. I like the noise of democracy. The government of the United States possesses no power whatever over the question of religion. Liberty must be allowed to work out its natural results, and these will, ere long, astonish the world. All the friends that I loved and wanted to reward are dead, and all the enemies that I hated and I had marked out for punishment are turned to my friends. If you are as happy in entering the White House as I shall feel on returning to Wheatland, you are a happy man indeed. If you are as happy, my dear sir, on entering this house as I am in leaving it and returning home, you are the happiest man in this country. I have gone wooing to several gentlemen, but have not succeeded with any of them. To avoid entangling alliances, has been a maxim of our policy ever since the days of Washington, and its wisdom no one will attempt to dispute. The course of events, is so rapidly hastening forward that the emergency may soon arise, when you may be called upon to decide the momentous question whether you possess the power, by force of arms to compel a state to remain in the Union. Abstract propositions should never be discussed by a legislative body. The distribution of patronage of the government is by far the most disagreeable duty of the president. <laughs>